that's a trailer cut in half by a train. <laughs> Good old Union Pacific. Wow, this is gonna be a lot of labor. Um, I got my land all in route. Oh, there's the other half of the trailer. Yeah, I'm gonna be here for quite a while, guys. <laughs> this is gonna be a fun job. Okay, guys, I got my game plan. I'm gonna split this. Got landing gears there. Put some wood here. Um, I'm gonna use dual spreader bars to lift this up underneath that sign and set it on the land all. Get some flatbeds for this and a forklift, get a crew here, then a separate land all. Or you know what, that can be towed with the heavy wrecker. Hold on. Uh, sir, am I able to cross over there? Around. I can walk around, right? Yeah, around, but you can't go through here. Okay. It's not too far to walk, No, no, I got it. I just want to make sure there's there's protocol with Union Pacific and all that. I got to see uh, if I could tow that with the wrecker or if I need two landalls. So give me a few minutes, I'll get my game plan, and then we'll work it. I'm going to take a walk around on the other side to see the other trailer real quick. Oh man, this is a good call, guys. <laughs> well, this is the other side. Bunch of looks like recyclable cardboard. And this looks towable. I don't know where we'll get it from. We'll have to cage the brakes. So I can use a wrecker for this. Now I gotta talk to the owner and the city to see what they're gonna do about all, all this junk if we're gonna be responsible for the cleanup let's make my way back around so you're the driver yes sir you guys have a cleanup crew the office of this uh, the, the company uh told from sí. okay que la compañía iba a levantar todo. all right so first things first um when you're ready i'm gonna just go forward if I need, I need this moved so I can back up here. I'm going to lift this up so we can get the tractor out of the way first. That's step one. So whenever you give me the green light. Well, this is going to be a, a long call. First steps first is I talk to the owner. We're handling everything 100%, all cleanup, all removal. Oh, I'm gonna get my workout in for the day. First steps first is I'm gonna lift that trailer so they can disconnect the fifth wheel and get that tractor out of here. Well, first steps first, actually, I gotta winch the tractor to me. So let's draw my cables. I'm gonna winch the tractor to me because the fifth wheel, uh, the lever's on the other side. You can see right there it's pretty pretty hidden we won't be able to pull it from here so i got to straighten this bad boy out on the boom only and sure enough I got power lines everywhere but I don't complain as long as I stay within my say 15 feet away
all those power lines everywhere. <gasps> Never fails, huh? Ever. Let's get my, uh, uh, I don't know, frame grab hook. I'm only gonna slide it to me to straighten out the tractor. That'll allow us to pull the fifth wheel, release it, and let the guy take off. This baby right here. This baby right here, my chain clutch. Dang! These people don't care, do they? Now we go boom up. Keep the tension on this. There we go. All right. Why they kept this lane open, I don't know. But. With the meter? Si puedes? Okay. Meter? Por favor, gracias. Tracking the boom while I'm holding the winch cable tight. And we'll do it one more time. It's working, it's working. I just hope that fifth wheel comes off easy. All right, right there should be good. Let's see if it came apart. Lo voy a hacer poquito para atrás. Sí, sí, sí. Oh, look how clutch these are. No damage. Boom. Love these. So the fifth wheel suck. He's gonna try to back up a little bit to release that tension. Let's see if it works. Perfecto. Listo. 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 So now he's gonna go forward. I hope your insurance is good. I want to get paid on this. Good. Step one of many. <laughs> now that I got this baby solo, I got a couple of options. How strong are these walls? Ooh. This is not a dry van. What I'm thinking is a um, dual spreader bar. 
a dual spreader bar with my two foot wide straps one under here and one under here the front sky up this whole thing and set it on the land all like that it's the only way i see possible it's the only way i see possible all right i just backed up so i can get it off the side i got habanero in the land already so two spreader bars on this job I'm gonna get my two foot wide straps, Joe. I think I'm at a good spot. Might have to back up more. Yeah, I'm gonna back up more. All right, I parked. All right, Joe. Double spreader bar time. I don't think I've done a double spreader bar job with Hulk yet. We are today, but we're doing it today. Uh, let me jump up there. Then I got a our Peppa's box trucking route and a flatbed for the labor on all this stuff. It's everywhere on the other side too. Hey, Joe, did you see that? See that. Hold on, not yet. Hold on, Joe. Let me go up there. No, he was carrying scrap or something. I don't know what he was, a private owner operator. He had a company, but. See, look, spreader bars are already preset. All we gotta do is put the. I got pictures of his uh, insurance and everything. How I'm gonna get payment is when I go home, I pray that he's insured and covered. Otherwise, this is all for free. Oh wait, no, the, the oblong, yeah. No, no, both of them have to go on one. So let me do mine first. Now you do your side. See, isn't it so much yeah, easier than the old way of setting yeah. up the spreader bar? You're right. Where we had to take everything together. apart. Don't we do that side now. Oh, but you, you have a... Was this one a 15 fighter? What? The strap. No, five what? footers. The five footer? Yep. Let's do this one first. We're doing it all, bro. Oh, you guys are all doing throwing it? On Everything. Yeah. I got I got a box trucking route, a flatbed and labor. We'll get it, we'll get it done. Friday. <laughs> Joe. Now put the snatch block on the oblong, please. Done. Now we set up this one. Let me get you the straps. You're recording us rigging this, right? <laughs> yeah, Joe. You want to make it a YouTube? You're getting famous on my channel now. Huh? You're getting famous on my channel now. Who's Joe? All right. Second spreader bar complete. Let me get you that cable. Be cool. You ready? Okay, tightening up. Ready? ready. Blue cable, tight. White cable, tight. I'll control this one, you control that one, yeah?
So much for me controlling this one. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Joe. Start swinging the boom so you can clear this. The lights, you don't hit it. So All right. I'm gonna have to. Uh, should I just swing this way? No, either way, the wife, you're already right here. Because I'm gonna yeah. hit all that. Okay, well, go all the way around. Will I? Let me see. Is it gonna hit? Yeah, you're good. You're That's why I don't pull them out to you. All right. Yeah. You hold all, Joe. Let me jump down and get it from this angle. stand here so I can monitor everything up there it's gonna be very tricky so what I'll do is I'll tuck in on the cables boom down even think about hitting Hulk there you go hold it I'm going down we'll set up right here let me get it far away so it isn't in case it does swing it won't hit my truck now we set up the straps you know what I gotta set up my straps from here. So, have you ever seen the inside of my toolbox? Probably wonder what this big yellow box is that I keep in here. Well, they're my two foot wide straps. I rarely use them, but now is a job for them. Oh, and my harness is in there. We'll take that out. You grab one, Joe, I'll grab the other. Oh, and I'll need my stick. So we don't have to call into the trailer. This one goes in front. That one is for the back, Joe. We're gonna do mine first, okay? So, feed it to me. Like this. Got it. Good, yeah, I got it. Go right behind the kingpin. Actually, right here. Good. Good. Next one. That one, go to the other side and I'll feed it to you. Grab it from underneath. Push it first? Yeah. Push it with the stick? Oh, see how far you go. No, we got it. I got it. Okay. Thank you. All in a day's work, right? Joe, help me with this. Okay. Give me uh, four of those while I get my straps. how calm I am during all this because I love stuff like this I mean who gets to do this and get paid for it 
absolutely incredible. Good. picking up a lot of weight in the front so uh i'm gonna use my five eighths for the front these ones all right now we set up the spreader bar by first connecting the shackles to my rope slings all four of them Good. You do the back side, I'll do the front side. Oh shoot. What am I thinking? The spider bar's over here. Joe, you connected it to the front member. Oh, yeah, totally. Guys, I'm like almost at 20 degrees right under the traffic light. I'll walk over on the other side so it's more visible, but yikes. Can someone shut that noise up? It. All right, lift off, baby. I got an idea. It's too cluttered in the back. I'm gonna try something. Check this out. I'm gonna bring it all the way to the front. You hold two ropes, I hold two ropes, then I swing it back. It's impossible to do it from back there. So just make sure it doesn't hit Hulk, please. Take those two and walk that way, please. No, 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 no. Other. Like you take the back to where I take these two. One side clear, Joe. We're gonna twist it. Where we got it backwards. You bring, bring those two over here. Are you ready? All right.
Got it. Now I walk it back to me. We're going to break this thing. If you have this one up right now, then it's right here, then we'll stretch this one that way. We're done. You do that. You do that one and I'll do mine. We're making great progress, fellas. And then we'll I'll rotate it to the front. All right, one side is done, so now we rotate. Swing mine. Straight in the sucker out. What the? What's it going over here? Got MacGyver's here. Huh? MacGyver's here. No way. With the van. With the walk Hey, MacGyver! Did they send you to spy on me? Yes. I was taking over. Perfect, thank you. It's a lot of labor. They gotta be opened up. You didn't open them up? Yeah, good idea. We got all the room in the world. I don't about no much better than that. Check that out, we got our own box truck. Lift gate and everything. We're gonna hammer down on this car. Hey Joe, how long have we been here? I wouldn't even say a whole hour yet. You. you oh, me? An hour. And I already split there. the tractor. We got the spreader bar already set up. We got the box truck here. We're doing great timing, man. You know PD's going to be happy with that. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is adjust and get a ton of height. That's as safely possible. Yeah, let's walk that one over and I'll tighten it, okay? Make sure it's open though. Yeah. Keep going. You're holding it? Okay. We'll go behind the fifth wheel because look how strong it is. Right behind it. Right, right there. there. Two angle irons? We're doing all this, right? We might as well. Now we get my angle irons. 
We have four, right? Yeah, I do. Do me a favor, grab the two on the on top. The two smaller ones. I'll get these two. What's that? Yeah, I do. So these protect the edge and it helps bring up so all the pressure isn't just on one part and to protect the strap as, as well give me too long all right oh you know what to do hold on i'm gonna make this easier on you just keep it right there You do that side, I'll do the other. Hold it in place, please. Hold it. Let me bring my back more. How you doing? Are you good? Yeah, how you doing? Okay, tightening up. Baby, that is gorgeous. Hello. <laughs> I got a. That? I don't know. Oh, that's. Uh, is that loud knobs? Loud knobs. Okay. Now that we did that, let's do the other side. Yes, we will. Back up. I'm, I'm lifting it now. I'm ready. Let me do a Tesla. Here, grab my gun right here. I'll grab the sockets. See what socket it is. Too big? Any first one you see. Is it these ones? Yeah. Oh, these are way too big, bro. Let's try a 15 16. Yeah. 15 16. Should I go higher? Now Joe's gonna try to take the landing gear off with my Milwaukee gun. Will it fit? take it like that and we'll mind it's gonna be hard but we'll go slow and take uh, the best truck route okay. so back up the lando then you want to plant I'm, I'm gonna show you guys a quick walk around while uh joe backs up he's got a u-turn it i got the front outriggers outriggers the landing gear barely touching so i won't drastically swing even though i'm perfectly centered now i don't think it will And once Joe's underneath, as close as he can, I raise it fully. What a monster job, ton of labor. Still loaded in the back. x 
that's the land all baby all the way back Joe as close as possible disconnect the winch cable because we're going to put that part on the deck like he said. Ah, yeah, good idea. Moment of truth. Yeah, loud labs. They get all my good stuff. One, two, three. Come on, Joe. You can't tell me you're not impressed. I've uh, Ishmael removed the, the box truck so you can back up all the way. All right? Right? Yeah. Ishmael, can you move the box truck? He's gonna back up. Try to get it straight and if, uh, as best you can. If not, I'll rotate it for you. Got it, Joe. Perfect. Hold it there. Uh, go for it. Actually, that's good. Joe! How's that? Yeah, you want what? It's not on the wind. I will just keep it on the metal, not on the wood. So drop it right here or no? Yeah, it's good right there to see how it does. Okay. You know what? The crooked landing gear is going to be an issue, Joe. Let me let out with the back cable first. A little bit that side, and, and then when you go down, it's gonna it's gonna land perfect. A little bit what side? That way. Lift it and go that way. Oh, so the pata goes over the. Yeah. So the so, leg goes over the. Yeah. When you go down, the box is gonna try to go th come this way, and it's gonna sit perfect in the back. Like one feet. You got ten. it. Ready? Yes. Ever so slowly. More and more. More. Mas? Good?
have a lot of tension. Yeah, in the back. We have chain right here. Look this side. I don't even get one that way. If they're here, I won't get to pay it. Shouldn't we put this one like right here? Because there's still a lot of slack if you go. Maybe like right here? This one? Might be easier, right? Thank you. I got zero tension. Okay, to prevent. Dang, this is crazy. My guys chain it up i have zero tension on it but i haven't fully disconnected in the event of a failure or, or something i still it'll catch itself now that we got that step done we have uh the cleanup and then i have that sucker back there you're next buddy all right so now the guys are going to be doing the chaining uh after the chaining I guess it's the cleanup of all this junk right here. And then that, that's mine. That's last. My men are already doing a uh, pretty good timing over there. We got two box trucks. We got everything, baby. Oh man, how tired are you, Joe? You're so tired, you can't even respond to me. Uh -huh. <laughs> I said, how tired are you? Tired, burned out. So uh, the good work we did. This was a pain to secure the trailer. We got this side completely done with all the wood. I got my other box truck and more men on the other side with the forklift on the, for that side. I had the spreaders bar, spreader bar still attached just for safety while we did all this rigging and tying down. You're gonna love this. You see these two straps? They're my heavy duty straps to go over the trailer. This is just for my safety. Bam to my Wreckmaster wrinkle on the Kingpin. How clutch is that? Yeah, that's cool. Show you a better shot from here. That is some good stuff. Almost done, guys. Almost done. Man, when I tell you this is a pain, it's a pain. So I got the spreader bars disconnected now that the trailer's really secure. And I think my guys are finished on the other side. When I say we made great timing, I mean we made some fantastic timing. Now to put Oak away. And drive around to the other side of this train. Who, uh, I'm going to be doing the tow for the back half of the trailer. Where, uh, yeah, it's the back half. I 
got to swing those other two off. There we go. See, if that was chain, I would have been really mad because I would have cracked my windshield. I got up there. <gasps> All right. Now I'm going to take this contraption off. I'll get back to you guys when I'm done. Well, we're done. The daunting task of putting gorgeous Hokule is done. Spreader bars and everything. Uh, trailer's fully secured. Thank you, Will, for the pizza. Super dope. Well, I guess, uh, standby time. Look how far back this stuff got knocked. You, you think I was kidding. You see it right there under the train? I mean, my poor guys, man. They hustled on this one. We're earning our dinner tonight. How much bonus are we getting today? Uh, like, like this. <laughs> there we go. Choop, choop. Maybe now with the light, you'll be able to see the front of it. I would hate to see their bill, man. <laughs> this is going to be a silly toe. Oh, it never ends. They got the train moved as you can see. So what I'm going to do now is rear tow this trailer. Which will look hilarious. I don't know who's going to be worse, me rear towing this or Joe with this. But in order to rear tow it, the tracks start right there and there's rocks. So I can't drive there, obviously. Jack up my truck, mess everything up. So I'm going to swing it to me and put it straight onto my underlift. This will be pretty cool. I'll grab it from right here. So just one spot only for now. And then as I get a clear shot of the whole back, I'll use two container slings and put it straight on the underlift. and slow pivot 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 what textbook is this now 
can hook that to the other side. Like that, Joe? I love clutch this is ah, I did okay all right DOT bumper or what yeah right there it's empty it weighs nothing I'm gonna get away with the going here thank you Joe now let me pull it to me Skid right now, okay? Don't be scared. Is that good? Now, as I let out, oh, we could just turn the under Joe, extend out with the underlift. Trust me. Right there's perfect. Just get them underneath and I'll make it straight. Hold it. to do under lift up Zero all the way down. look right in between ah okay extend in there fold up Joe boom up Tilt up. Check this out. <laughs> oh, let me get this out of the way first. These will prevent it from going back and forth. Very good. Slowly. If anything, you could boom up. Now tilt up. Okay, now we cage the brakes, Joe. Oh, we will. But let me cage the brakes first. I got all my tools on the other side. Now I'm under here to cage the brakes. And of course, this guy's got no caging bolts because why would he? So, I don't know, I've Enrique. Grab me the ones in Hulk. But you always carry your own. 
caging the brakes since obviously there's no air being supplied to this right out of the this would have been the front of it well there's nothing there and here are all the lines so to release the brakes you manually cage them by putting a bolt in here they're essentially a giant spring and you compress it that releases the brakes right now they're fully extended all right these are what they look like You gotta be careful with these. There's always a chance that you tie it in too hard. That's why it's not recommended to use a gun, but let's see. These could, ki these could kill you. Oh geez, and of course it's not going in. I'm gonna need a, a hammer and some vice grips. It's all jacked up in there, but I'll force it. Might as well start with the other side. Okay, one, two down. Wow, that's what these babies are for. All right, Joe, thank you for chaining that. Go in and out, test it. Wheels roll freely. Very good. Nice and tight. Nice Frankenstein hookup. <laughs> hey, good thing it's night now. Minimal traffic. Yeah. Whoa, excuse me. Gotta get MacGyver in the video. Shout out Will for helping out. Instagram number one fan. What other fans you know show up to your Rex and actually help you? <laughs> and free pizza. Team, when I say you guys did great, I mean you did great. Hey, look at my best time. <laughs> Two box trucks full, both just put away. If you guys want to laugh? Let me show you a whole story. <laughs> Check this out. Safety first. You gotta have the light bar. Bam strapped it so this wasn't sticking out now it's more flush except for obviously this part picked up all the cardboard all the way where the light is like right there it's all right here all good last two pallets fit on here All right. Look at that. That is some Frankenstein chaining. I love it. It's funny that the cleanup and the repalletizing all the wood or cardboard, it's like three times longer than the actual recovery. All right, I guess I can do a bonus shower round. Let's see what's in the goodie bag. I got soap mouthwash toothbrush toothpaste Savage. yes sir hey say who those cold from over there are they our cones no then no they, they left a long time as soon as i was doing this they left they bounced ah that was a big mess soap nothing like a hand bar of soap Who's got a bar of hand soap in their rotator? Oh yeah, nothing like a good shower. <laughs> what the heck kind of evil laugh was that? Did you guys...
on this, Joe? Fucking tired. Here. <laughs> hey, I got actual okay. face wash in there. Oh, I feel good. Just yeah. Like that. Fucking good. Face off. Fucking all day. Okay. I'm gonna do that at the shop. I right. just wanted to wash. I don't like being in there with dirty hands. complete nothing like finishing up a dirty dirty job and driving away clean the good thing is we're in the city of Vernon if you're familiar with the area uh, Vernon is a border border city to where my shop is at so we just take here all the way down to the turns into Grande Vista and take Olympic to the shop <sighs> That's gonna be fun. You ready, Joe? Let's bounce. Got all the lights on, following Joe for safety. Make sure we get back safe. Hey, Joe, I'm gonna just be following you in the right lane. Uh, just cause that outrigger, the, I mean the landing gear is sticking out, I don't want to get close to you, so we'll just kill these two lanes to the shop, okay? Perfect. Well, we made it back. That was a very fun drive. What? We had to, uh, we don't want to put it in the yard, so we put it here on the slab. <laughs> oh, I cannot wait for the insurance adjuster to come see this. They got hit by a what? So drove back the land all up here on the slab. And I backed up the trailer to it for well, the other half. I'm thinking insurance adjuster is going to have a field day with this one. <laughs> and... We're out of here. Peace out, guys.